Hello everybody, Miss Melissa here, ready to celebrate the letter Q with you. But before we get started, let's practice our alphabet. Let's sing the alphabet song together. Are you ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time won't you sing with me? Great job, friends. All right, so let's talk about that letter Q. We have our capital Q and our lowercase Q. And Q is a tricky word. There's not a lot of words that start with Q, but we have a few like Quilt. Quilt starts with Q. And quilt is a special blanket someone might make for you by piecing together pieces of fabric. Let's see. Ooh. Question. Question starts with Q. This is a question mark. The type of bird this is? This is a quail. And quail starts with Q. Queen. Queen starts with Q. Quiet. Quiet starts with Q. And for our book character, we have little quack because quack starts with Q. Quack, quack. All right. Now for our flannel activity today, we are going to be talking about quiet. And we're going to do a little activity that is called loud or quiet. So it's quiet with the Q right there. And we are gonna, I'm gonna hold up some things and we're gonna guess whether they are loud items or quiet items. So let's try an alarm clock. Ding, 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 ding. Is that loud or quiet? That's loud, it has to be loud to wake us up. That's gonna go with the loud. How about a fluffy cloud in the sky? Is that loud? No, it doesn't make any noise, so it's quiet. Let's put that over here. Let's see. How about a horn? Honk, honk. That's loud. Let's put it over here with the alarm clock. Or how about an ant? Do you hear ants making a lot of noise? No, ants are quiet. Let's put that with the cloud. How about a pillow? A pillow is quiet, that's right. We don't want a noisy pillow. How would you ever sleep? <gasps> But what about a fire truck? A fire truck is loud, right? What sound does a fire truck make? Whoa, those are some great fire truck sounds. Great job. How about a plant? Does a plant make a lot of noise? No, a plant is quiet. Let's see. Oh, this one's a little tricky. A tea kettle. Have you, anybody heard a tea kettle? When the water boils in a tea kettle, it whistles really, really loud so that you know that the water is boiling. So a tea kettle is loud. How about a teddy bear? Teddy bears are nice and quiet to cuddle with, right? Or a snail. Does a snail make noise? No, a snail's nice and quiet. How about a burp? A burp can be quiet or loud. We're gonna say that this, this looks like a really loud burp. So we're gonna say burps are loud. Let's see. How about a rooster? cock a doodle doo Like a rooster is loud. 
And we've got one more. A bunny. Is a bunny loud or quiet? Bunny is quiet, right? You don't really hear many noises from a bunny. So now we have all of our loud items and all of our quiet items. And look, they're all different colors too. All of the loud items were yellow and all of the quiet items were blue. Great job, everyone. Thank you so much for helping me with that. Until next time, let's get those waving hands out. Are you ready? We wave goodbye like this. We wave goodbye like this. We clap our hands for all our friends. We wave goodbye like this. Goodbye, everybody.